So what do we got going on here? Hey there, Pooch. You hoping to head over to the city too? I'm afraid no one's going anywhere at the big drawbridge like that. Even the checkpoint guards don't know why it's been raised. But there's something big fishy going on. Hey, you understand what I'm saying, eh? Want me to let you know, in, let you in on a rumor I heard? Apparently, there's some mysterious illness in Saiyan City. I wouldn't normally believe that kind of rumor, of course, but thinking about when I first heard it, well, I was right around. It was right around the time the bridge was raised. If the rumor is true, then I guess there's no hurry to leave here. Oh, what a cute little doggy! Are you stuck here too? That big bridge over there? People call it the Big Drawbridge. It's what links Taka Pass with the city. As you can see, they keep the bridge raised these days, though. I wonder what's going on over in the city. I suppose we'll find out, considering that's where we're heading. I hear birds. Also, this is a treasure chest. If you headbutt it too early, you don't actually count as opening it, which kind of sucks. There they are. true right here. Who? What? Oh, uh, ahem. This is the checkpoint for Saiyan City. This big drawbridge is the only way in or out, but no one is allowed into the city right now. That's an absolute order from Queen Himiko. Say, you know the Phoenix statues that protect this checkpoint. Well, they burned with the sacred flames that drove away evil. However, they had been out until recently. Sacred flames should never go out. Maybe that rumor is true. You've heard that rumor, haven't you? No. You haven't heard the rumor about the huge curse zone? Everyone's up in arms because it happened so close to the big day. By the big day, I mean the Kamiki festival held each year. Plus, it was the 100th festival since that monster was defeated. So everyone's saying it's the 100 year curse. Of course, I was the first one to start spreading that rumor. Of course you were. Oh, uh, the curse zone is gone and peace is returned. What's more, the sacred flames return to the phoenix statues. Now I won't have to worry about monsters sneaking up at night. Uh, anyway, you've heard that rumor, haven't you? A million times. I see. Guess I can't remember who I've told it to. I've sold so many. Yeah, I'm not talking to you. Don't worry, we're going to talk to the guard here in a second. Excuse me. Mother tree, otherwise known as Sakuya's tree. Feed some piggies. Well, I guess technically these are boars, but you know. Get it. <laughs> Street bead, yay. Nope, that's not where I want to dig. Give the tanukis some meat. Pretty sure there's another chest. Yeah, there it is. Look, another stray bead. 
There's also a clover down here. All right. Now let's go talk to that other guard up there. Yoichi! Hello there. What's the matter, Poochie? Why a sad look? You'll never get anywhere looking like that. It's bad luck. I'm Yoichi, the greatest archer among all the city guards. Ooh. Holy smokes, that's some bow you got there, mister. What's this? You brought a friend along with you, Poochie? This is my trusty bow, Goldenfire, the most powerful in all the land. Guarding is rather dull work, so I pass the time practicing archery. I'll show you what I can do. Watch this. Nice. Wow, bullseye. Pretty good, eh? Not a target golden fire and I can't hit. Now, my friends, why not have a, bit, a bite to eat and relax a bit? Okay, so basically what you got to do is Set his bow or his arrow on fire. <laughs> we'll go down into the cannon and make it explode. <laughs> Who knows if there were people over there in those buildings? I don't. But now we have the drawbridge down. What in the world? This is terrible. Nothing like this has ever happened before. My arrow suddenly burst into flames. No, no. I just remembered I have business to attend to back in the city. Well, seeing how the bridge is back down and all, I better get back to my bar guarding job in the city. And I'm not just saying that only to disappear on some adventure. Yoichi, the greatest archer, would never create dream of such an act. Well, goodbye and good luck. And leaving a trail of apples behind him. Yeah, it's a bit of a mess over here now. Somebody should probably clean that up. Somebody like us. I just started digging. <laughs> Crazy how planting some flowers does this. <laughs> it gets rid of a broken, blown up building and spawns in some horses. Crazy how that works. Hashtag magic. Ugh. Another stray bead. All it takes to clean up a blown up building 
is planting flowers in two spots. That's all it takes. Bunch of praise right here. Bunch of praise. Which is useful. Come on. Jesus. So now. Oh, we're so close. So close. But anyway, let's move on. I believe that's pretty much all we can do here for now. Hey, hey, the big city. You'll probably find the pace of city life pretty shocking, Amy, considering how you were stuck out in the boonies for a hundred years. As for me, I can't wait to check out all the cute babes. Hey, hey, hey. God, you're such a pervy soon. Such a perv. Wait, I thought you said we were going to the city. This isn't the city. This is the coastline. Rawr, 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 rawr. Hey, what the heck's going on? Rochi's stupid curse zone spread all the way here? I mean, this is even past the city checkpoint. And besides, we already did away with that sneaky serpent. Can't believe the curse zone hasn't gone away here. Must have been one strong curse for this wasteland to survive even after its maker croaked. Still, I wonder. It's almost like there's more to the story than just Orochi. Got to get rid of this curse. And how do we do that? The guardian sapling, of course. It's a statue. We're fighting a statue. So here's how the glaives work. It's kind of the similar to the uh, to the reflectors, but um, I'm pretty sure that the finisher for these guys is cherry bombs. But the timing is so hard to get down on those. You can also charge up the glaives, but I don't know. like I said, I'm not really a huge fan of them. Just figured I'd show it to you guys so you see how it works. Okay, we can't go in there yet. Gotta go this way first. Okay, so I always thought this puzzle was kind of dumb. So basically what they want you to do here is they want you to move the water from here into here and then from here to here. But you know what else you can do? You can just go straight to here. <laughs> There's no need for the barrel, <laughs> like at all. It's just there for some reason. And then you cut. Where are you going? And then you do the same thing. You move the water from here to up here. Where am I? What the fuck just happened? Okay. Uh, I really don't know how that just happened. Oh, <laughs> 
Hmm? This is a guardian sapling, isn't it? Poor little thing withered up before it could even bloom. Need to pep it up a bit before making it bloom. Basically, this is why we've been moving all this water. Oh, look at it go. Look at it go. It's a thirsty tree. It's a thirsty boy. Beautiful. All right, favorite part of the game right here, guys. Beautiful, beautiful. We have restored the coast to its former glory. Whoa, that curse is out of here. Now this is the Ryoshima coast I know and love. Actually, I really don't know it all that well, but see that sunken ship? I don't remember ever seeing it there before. But anyway, Ryoshima Coast is where you'll find the big city. Saiyan City is just a bit of a walk from here. You'll find almost anything you can imagine there. How about we mosey on over, Furball? Sure, right after we feed these birds. Oops. Also, the fact that she can't swim in that water is... Or just walk in that water is hilarious to me. Cows! It's cows! I love cows. They're very tasty. I'm sorry, was that fucked up of me to say? Sorry. Sorry! Ooh, look, a red demon scroll. I believe that if you try to jump into a battle with the red one, you can't escape it. I think you have to fight it. So here's something cool. Look where we are! We're in the fortune teller's house in Agata Forest. Not that we really need to be in there. Just figured I'd show it to you guys. But real quick, let's go ahead and upgrade the ink. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pots. Eight ink pots. I may have miscounted that. Don't judge me if I did. Uh, sir, where are your clothes? This is a shame about the ship stranded out there on the rocks. I mean, it was so close to the port, but then it was attacked by that terrifying water dragon and sunk. People say there's an invaluable treasure in it, too. But the water dragon makes it too dangerous to sail these seas. Water dragon? You should think twice about bathing here, you know. The water dragon wouldn't hesitate to snap up a wolf like you. What's this water dragon you keep talking about? You don't know about the water dragon? The huge dragon god rampaging about in the seas around here. It's supposed to be the god of the sea, keeping peace in the oceans. But one day it just went crazy and started attacking people. All the ships bring food to the city. All the ships bringing food to the city were sunk by it. The queen must have been beside herself. Apparently there's an invaluable treasure on that ship over there, but it's been left like that ever since the water dragon sunk it. Interested in the valuable treasure on the ship, are you? Apparently he was carrying a huge cargo of treasure. 
and I heard about this weird mallet that makes you as small as a bug. You can get through gaps as small as the eye of a needle with it. Can't think what on earth you could use it for, though. <laughs> Looks like you were expecting some cash instead, eh? Anyway, you really shouldn't be bathing here. Water dragon, yeah. Heard that part. Feed the foxes. Pop in is a little bit bad in this game, but it's fine. It adds to the charm. Oh, how inconvenient. The ancient Enkoku temple is at the top of the hill here, but the priestess in charge is always busy and never there. I'm afraid you, you've had a wasted journey like me, wolf. All these people are just so comfortable, just chilling with a wolf. Enkoku's temple, Enkoku Temple's head priestess practices monster subduing magic, so if there is any trouble in the city, they call her for help. And there's been nothing but trouble in Saiyan City lately. I hope the priestess will be back before too long. Me too, for your guys' sakes. bunnies I don't believe bunnies would actually live this close to water like the like the sea I mean <laughs> not here to get important lore from you I'm here to sell you shit and buy shit Got some little dark spots we can clear out. I always forget they want seeds. Always forget. Every time I play this game. Fixing the, the land, one little by little, everybody. This is all it takes to save the planet. We just need the gods. <laughs> That's all we need. Random pig hanging out with all these boars. What's up, bro? Where did he go? I just can't think where my Inaba could have gone. It's one of the dangers of keeping pets. Have you seen him, pup? Is he Naba? It's a bunny. He's missing his bunny. Did 
There is a chest all the way at the end of this pier. And also... Cats! Freaking cats, man! It's freaking cats! I love cats. They're so sweet. And finally, we get to feed something fish. Haven't been able to do that all game. So that's how we go to the city. We go up there. But first, we're actually going to go over to that this building over here because it's another dojo. And I believe we should have some new, um, new techniques available to us. To learn. Oh, that's right. I forgot about the clamshells, too. Oh, come on. Let me make it. Let me make it. Hoping to do it without a lily pad, but it didn't let me because it's rude. Monkey. Monkeys. What are you doing here? I'm as elusive as my fighting skills, friend. Be it a lone isle among the waves or the most frigid mountain peak, I forge a warrior's path throughout the land. And what has brought you here? Yes, we shall bite, buy things. We are gonna buy these two things and probably some that as well if we have enough money. And that. Uh, Holy Eagle, double jump. We're gonna learn double jump. Yep, 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 I know, I know, I'm aware, yep. It's, yep, same shit every time. Da -da -da -da. Oh, thanks. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can jump up to the moon turret. Because now we can double jump, which will make exploration much easier. Digging champ, another very useful one. Now we can dig through those hard rocky patches that we have seen around and about. leveling up all over the place guys we're just constantly improving ourselves let me skip this oh my god why can i not skip that part i can skip every other part yeah we got the money so We have now extended our combo with the reflectors up to five hits. Nope. Come on. Let me go. 
Not gonna sit there and do it 12 times just so I can get a, a bone. And then we're gonna buy this one, Wailing Mirror. So now when we have mirrors equipped in both the main and the sub uh, slots, that actually bumps up the attack power even more than how it how much they already deal. So And they have one of those for every for all three weapon types, but again, it still doesn't matter because the reflectors are just the most powerful. That's pretty much all we need to worry about now, because like I said, I'm not really, we're not using the rosaries, not going to use the glaives, and plus we don't have enough money for it anyway, so. So uh, now we've got some fancy schmancy new techniques. We can actually dig right out here. We got a treasure chest we can get now. And a place to double jump up to. And that is actually where I am going. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Damn it. I made it nighttime. I was trying to make it daytime. <laughs> uh, I am actually going to end it here, guys. Um, it's been a couple hours, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please comment or not comment. Well, comment if you like. I, I don't get many comments, so I would actually appreciate that. But um, subscribe and like the video if you wouldn't mind. I would greatly appreciate it. And I will see you next time. Bye, guys.